In an historic move, Pulaski County announces it will now recognize tomorrow, Juneteenth, as an official holiday. Tonight, our Ashley Godwin shows us why this holiday is about more than celebrating the end of slavery. It's about hope for a brighter tomorrow. There's been so much unrest in the United States as George Floyd and several other African American lives have been taken by the hands of police. But now Central Arkansas is moving step forwards and making sure that every American and every life is respected and recognized. One of the things that Juneteenth really signifies is a feeling of hope. It was a moment of hope on June 19, 1865, when the last of the slaves in Galveston, Texas, were told they were free. And of course, they had been free two and a half years earlier uh, by the Emancipation Proclamation, but it took that long for the Union soldiers to get to Galveston. This was the beginning of hope for equality, hope for civil rights, a hope for a brighter future. But more than 100 years later, African Americans are still fighting for that hope. What will stand the test of time is where do we go from here? Um, what are the things that change as a result of this moment in time? What are the structural and systemic policies um, that change? Dismantling racism, dismantling um, the isms of our world are about dismantling structural oppressions that keep um, marginalized people down. Making the importance of Juneteenth even more clear, bringing hope when it's needed most. You know, we know that things aren't equal. We know that things aren't equitable in this country. And so, um, you know, Juneteenth is an opportunity to um, both celebrate, you know, how far we've come as a country, but also where we need to go, right? The hope for a brighter tomorrow and a better day. In Little Rock, Ashley Godwin, THV 11 News.